was your reason for wanting to adopt? Thank you for that question, Bev. Uh, the world is a troubled place, and so many children in need of adoption worldwide. Mm. Any other... Infertility? Or other? Other. How old are you, Liz? 37. I should tell you right now it's important that you don't lie. How often do you entertain gentlemen sex guests? Oh, boy, that's uh, once a year? Maybe, but I'd be open to cutting that down. Is, is that a safety thing? Because I can fix that. You ever run a webcam ring out of here, Liz? Gentlemen tell you what to do, you do it. At first with some feigned hesitation. No. Is that on the form? Have you ever been convicted of a crime? Mm. I was arrested once in Germany for public nudity. I thought it was a topless beach. It was a shipyard. You're a TV writer, Liz. How many hours per week do you work? Between 60 and 80. Is that a work call? Could be. Or it could be my annual sex guest. <laughs> Your work life seems very demanding. Maybe I should pop by there tomorrow. Oh, hi. May I hear you? Ah, I'm Bev. I'm here to do Liz's adoption evaluation. Oh, of course. I think adoption is a wonderful thing. Three of my nine siblings were adopted. And someday, I'm going to find them. When... Bev, hi. Thank you, Kenneth. <laughs> So this is our studio. It would be a really fun place for a kid to grow up. Lots of costumes. Ah! Watch out! Nice job, jackass. We're like a big family here. Hey, Rick. I'm Fred. Rick is the other black guy. Happens to everyone, right, Bev? <laughs> yeah. Happens all the time to my black husband. Well, I first met Liz in 1993. She was fresh out of college, and I had just broken up with O.J. Simpson. And can I just say something? Total gentleman. Liz is a really, really mature person, and she totally deserves to get custody of her kids. It's not a custody case. Liz is trying to adopt a child. Then who were those kids you were yelling at the other day? Those were some child actors who had lied about being able to break dance. Actually, I lived with Liz while I was separated from my wife in a platonic way. Um, but I haven't lived there for a couple months now because I've been in an anger management treatment center because I shot one of my coworkers with an arrow. I think it's a circus in the Philippines. The lion goes nuts and attacks this older clown. How did we get started talking about this? Did you bring it up? Oh, nerds, it's Bev. Please be charming. Hello, Bev. I'm Jack Donaghy. Have you had a tour of our magnificent studio? I have not. Look right this way. This is what you're giving me as a thank you gift, some coupons for free hugs? I'm suing you for my share of your video game profits, Tracy. You're gonna sue me? Oh, yeah. Would you like to see the green room? The San Diego Zoo? What? You mean the nursery? You gotta get this stuff back to the rental place by 5 o'clock. I love you, Mommy. I love you. Dear God, Miss Lemon, did you lie to me about there being a nursery here? No. Rick, what are you doing? Bitch, my name is Fred. <laughs> It's very disturbing, Liz. This is a very serious breach of trust. Uh, Bev, allow me to explain. I've been mentoring Lemon for some time now. Are you her boss? Uh, no, I work in the mail room. <laughs> Kathy, Bev and I are just friends. <laughs> Kathy's the new CEO of our company. Bev, you better run. She's surprisingly <laughs> strong. <laughs> Change that hat! 